Hello everybody, hello and welcome. My name is Jake and I'm the community manager here at Pixel Worlds headquarters. Today we're talking about our new update, the Christmas and the New Year's update. And uh, what is going to be in that and what is going to happen when the Christmas and the winter comes to Pixel Worlds. So what we're going to go through all the features and elements that are going to change and come into the game in this episode. So uh, why don't we get started because there is a list, I would say. First thing on my list is a character related update and uh, that is a new expression. So a character feature that you can unlock with gems or you can also unlock it uh, with your levels to gain access to that expression. We're also bringing you guys two other facial expressions that you can use as well. So um, when they come inside the game, you can go and check out them from the expression tab, what it would look like with your character. A lot of you guys have been asking for a new booster and when Christmas is almost here, you probably are gonna figure out that, yeah, a Christmas booster would be nice. And uh, here it is, an Xmas booster is coming into the game. It has some of the old items that it had last year, because of course Christmas tree is going to be Christmas tree every year. But um, there's almost half of it completely new items. Personally, I think they are very cool and the new frost items are totally awesome and gotta say to Endless that it was a marvelous job that uh, what he has done with this update. Next up is a new blueprint and that is going to be the frost necklace that is going to give you um, kind of the same kind of an effect that uh, the glimmer necklace would give you but instead of glimmer uh, it will give you a frost effect. And a lot of these new items are themed around Frost. Frost Cape is not coming back, guys. So don't worry, it won't be coming back. And then we're gonna go to the new familiars and they are cute. So the two new familiars are limited time only and they're only going to be here for about this uh, one month that this update is going to be live. And these familiars are snow -o ball and a small baby penguin. Both of these guys have three different evolves and I'm not going to show them to you. Uh, you can go and evolve one for yourself and then check it out. But yeah, they are totally, totally cute. From last year, of course, now we're talking about frost and uh, winter and snow. So the snow background is once again in the game. You can now go and buy um, the winter orb background from the shop like you could last year. So it has come back and also the winter pack where you get snow, snow background, ice and ice background that has come back into the game. So you can go and create your own um, winter themed worlds inside the pixel worlds. So that's all about the shop items. And now we have gone through the character related and then the shop items. And now we are going to talk about the events because there are two different events coming into Pixel Worlds. The first one is going to be a Christmas event and the second one is going to be a New Year's event. In the Christmas event, there will be snowflakes that could spawn in your world. From these snowflakes, you're able to get the Christmas presents. From these Christmas presents, you can go and destroy them and it will give you one random item from all the boosters that we have published and we have released to you guys since the past one year that the Pixel World has been live. And I also mentioned that we're going to bring you guys another event. After the Christmas event ends, we're going to begin the New Year's event. The New Year's event is going to be all about fireworks you're going to be able to buy new fireworks from the shop during this event. The event is going to last about one week, so you can only buy these at that time. There's going to be 10 different fireworks 
more rare ones and more common ones and some amazing ones. And with this, there is this new particle system that we created inside the Pixel Worlds. There's a lot of changes in this update, but there's not a lot of new features. Um, of course, the fireworks are a new feature as well. But on top of that, there is going to be one new feature that is coming in the form of an item. And those are the ice skates. So you can use these ice skates to move much easier on uh, ice surface. These ice skates are going to give you much better control of your character on ice. I'm not going to tell you a lot more about that because I'm gonna let you uh, go and try that. Now let's go to the last changes that we're going to do to the Pixel Worlds and updates uh, that are coming live with this update. First one of these is something that you guys have been asking a lot. And um, you guys have been saying that the soil block, uh, it's so hard to destroy or other blocks as well. For some of the basic blocks in the game, we have reduced the breaking point. For example, soil blocks from now on only take three hits to break. So before they took five hits to break and now they are only going to take three. I hope you guys are going to enjoy this um, new change in the mechanics and how easy it is going to be to break the basic blocks in your world. And for example, it's going to be a lot faster to clear your world uh, when you're trying to build a great new world from scratch. Um, new daily bonus prizes, of course, we're going to add them to the normal section and uh, then also to the VIP section. If you remember one of our previous daily bonus prizes uh, from the VIP section, uh, there was this Ninja Pickle. And we have added a new Evolve for that uh, particular familiar and it is called the Sensei Pickle. In this update we're not doing a lot of changes to the netherworld but in the future there's going to be a lot of new updates coming related to that and we are designing them right now but that's going to be happening next year so in a month or two. But one thing we changed related to Nether and uh, that is the entering animation. So when you enter or somebody else enters to Nether, it's going to look a little bit different. The second to last is a new animation that any spear weapons will have when you hit another player or you hit blocks or anything else. It will look a little bit like more logical uh, when you use those spears. So it's going to be more of a thrusting sword. Last but definitely and not least is going to be uh, various bug fixes that we are going to add into the game. Here are all the events, features and items that are going to come in this new update. I know it's a little bit bigger one for this Christmas and the next update is going to come around the mid of January. Talking about the end of this year and Christmas and New Year, um, our YouTube episodes and YouTube channel is going to be on a small break during this time, but we'll be coming back at the start of January. So don't worry guys, we will be coming back at the start of January. Thank you very much, have a Merry Christmas and Happy New Year and I'll see you next year here on our YouTube channel and of course I'll see you in Pixel Worlds.